Hi guys, in this flash and action script 3 lesson, I take the uh the first preloader uh progress bar and text tutorial that I made just a little bit further by implementing uh inside of the action script, I implement a the complete listener for the uh for the loader info and um that complete listener allows you to uh have a function ready to give you a little more control over what the file does when it reaches 100 percent so when it reaches 100 percent I have it set to uh, it says current frame plus one which is just a fancy way to say go to and stop frame two and so when it hits frame two is where your content is and the content this is very important is one solid movie clip it's called my whole site and it doesn't need an instance name, I just instance named it so you'd see what it was. Uh, but it's my whole site. And once you double click on that and you go inside, there'd be your, your regular timeline just like your regular site would be structured out. But put it inside of a movie clip because it preloads a whole lot better. And uh, it's better for uh, all around organization of your file. So on your main scene, all you have is your preloader code on frame one. And then on uh, frame two all you have is the uh, the entire content of your file so it makes your main scenes timeline very organized and neat and then inside of uh, the whole the whole site movie clip here is where you structure out your giant timeline and layers and all that good stuff so uh, let's take a look at this thing in the browser and uh, here it is at develop PHP and I'm going to refresh and we'll hopefully see it working. Okay, there it is working. And you'll see that the uh, dynamic text is reading. I made it extra, extra bulky. I put giant pictures inside of the FLA file to make it uh, really... Sorry about that. The video started playing. Uh, but I made it extra, extra bulky so that way we can see some good progress here on the page. And you can see that it goes exactly to 100 and then enters the file and what I did was I set up some graphics to where there's kind of uh, faded out boxes in the back and then the load bar uh, it's a mask that shows the blue the bright blue boxes so uh, go ahead and close that out but that way you can see it working and you know it works uh, and if you take this file and you download it uh, which you can download from developphp.com in the flash tab uh, under the uh, flash tutorials you'll find this lesson and you can download the file and then once you get inside of it uh, you may just want to use this file as your beginning structure or maybe you, you don't want it because I have the library pretty packed up but you can remove all the items from the library uh, that are in the main site movie clip here and then start with your own movie your own flash site on uh, the file content frame 2 and uh, let's see I'll show you that graphic I was talking about so there's the light gray bar and uh, right there if I make it to where you can't see the mask you'll see the bright blue bars uh, boxes so there's the bright blue boxes, there's the dark gray boxes, and the mask is a magenta or pink symbol there. I made it bright pink so you can see it real good. Uh, and that's what grows over these blue bars to reveal and show them. So this one will help you guys uh, if you have a bulky full flash website um, and you need to uh, preload it give your users some indication of what's happening tell them something's loading into the browser okay we'll see you guys next lesson